Remember like the dubstep version of that song? Okay, so I'm Colton. I'm Sammy. And I'm Sam. And Sammy, what did you just force Sam and I to watch? Oh man, the best movie ever. So I have this childhood fascination with the Nutcracker solely because I had this straight to VHS Nutcracker cartoon that was, I guess, a knockoff of Barbie's a Nutcracker. I don't really know. But... Barbie's a Nutcracker. <laughs> Barbie's a Nutcracker. <laughs> we literally just finished watching this movie. Yeah, we're gonna be like a little, we might be a little late to the to the new Nutcracker play though. I feel like every time I see a version of the Nutcracker, the story's completely different. Each and time. it's always fucking insane. Yeah. That's the like one thing it has in common. I mean, half of the ballet is like the different kingdom people presenting themselves to the Nutcracker King and Oh Marie. yeah. Like, it's kind of like cats. Sugar... Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I've seen the Nutcracker Ballet. Okay. When I was younger, uh, actually, we went for school like every year for like five years. I can't stand the Nutcracker <laughs> anymore. <laughs> I went exactly once because I had a crush on and was like later dating one of the ballerinas. And it was fun. Uh, the Nutcracker, <laughs> I don't remember. I truly, I think I fell asleep. I truly don't remember it at all. Sammy is dragging <laughs> us to see The Nutcracker uh, uh, Brought to you by Glade My two favorite things uh, Tim Burton-esque looking movies and Cindy Campbell's <laughs> <laughs> So what do we know about this film? Uh, I know it has Keira Knightley doing a baby voice in it Oh god, I haven't watched any of the trailer <laughs> Yeah, I know literally nothing about this <laughs> it, looks, it looks terrible My godfather Drosselmeyer I wonder if he'll have an eye patch He, he does from Does he have owl poster. powers? Yeah, can he transform into an owl like in the animated movie? Is that canon to the Nutcracker? <laughs> Is that official Nutcracker canon? You guys need to adjust your attitudes and, and like warm your hearts up and be prepared for an influx of Christmas spirit. You know what my greatest fear is right now? Christmas? What if I like it? Uh, what if it's good? You'd be so happy because you'd have a new thing you enjoy and things that you enjoy bring you joy. That's why it's called enjoying. That is a very positive and Christmassy way to look at that film. Um, listen, I found soup. Found soup? Yes, I have soup. I always, <laughs> listen, always keep a spare soup in the back seat. You never know when you're gonna need it. Literally after the first four people, I don't recognize a single one. Some guy named Prince is playing Jingles the Horse. Prince is in it? Prince. Some it's guy Prince. named Prince. I don't think it's the same Prince because he's dead. Well, could Jingles the Horse just be a horse named Prince perhaps? Is it? I bet that's a cool fucking horse. The horse Shit. formerly known as Prince. <laughs> the horse. <laughs> yeah. No one wants a Nutcracker movie. Like, <laughs> who cares about the Nutcracker? Who is this movie for? I wonder if this movie is going to keep the same central theme of the animated one that we watch, which is that essentially this is a story about a virgin cracking his first nut. <laughs> All right, well, let's see how this goes. <laughs> I, I don't want to get out of the car. I don't want to go. So uncomfortable. <laughs> God damn. Kira Knightley, he doesn't show up until probably like an hour into the movie. She plays the sugar plum fairy. Yeah, she talks with like Harley Quinn times three baby voice. Like when you're making fun of something, you're like, yeah, fuck me. Like it's like that voice <laughs> the whole time. And yeah. like in this kids movie, it made me feel so uncomfortable that like I couldn't look at the screen. At I think first. it got way worse later, Ooh. personally. Because at least I felt like she got it, she gotta <laughs> own it later. She gotta like like it was yeah. like this is supposed to be sexual now, kind of. I have got the biggest crush right now on Kira Knightley as the sugar plum fairy. Uh, the baby boys 
was working for me. I <laughs> My favorite part is that like Kira Knightley, the stuff I know her from, in those movies she's trying really hard to be taken seriously and it was just really weird that in this movie she was like, you know what, <laughs> fuck it. Thing. Morgan Freeman's fucking sleepwalking. <laughs> 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 They're in London and here comes American Morgan Freeman and like Oh yeah, <laughs> I didn't even realize like, they didn't even try giving him like... an accent. They're like, man, you know what kids love is sad kids in London. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> We're gonna use that to book at our film. You know what else kids love? Real sad dads. <laughs> Just the saddest dad that you can think of. Dad's got three kids. Sad. And the mother leaves this like present for the middle child that leads her to a magical wonderland full of sugar plum berries and like <laughs> toy soldiers and stuff. Um, and the other two kids, she's like, have this dress. Here's a toy. Here's a here's a wooden doll <laughs> yeah. for your son. <laughs> and it ends with him being like, "You were her greatest creation." The other yeah. two kids like kind of wander into the frame. Yeah. <laughs> I thought it was really uh, funny how like they framed it. I mean, they do this a lot in kids movies. They'll be like, "There's two sisters. Mm -hmm. One's really smart and like science, and the other one." plays with her hair but there's Sorry. like when she opens up the egg and like it's slow turned to be like revealed that all she needed all along was her it was like a mirror i uh. thought so badly it was gonna be like your appearance is important like, <laughs> <laughs> you should pay more attention to your hair like, it's like truly that movie wasn't as bad as i thought maybe it was going to be the Kira Knightley baby voice thing threw me for a fucking loop <laughs> i'm the queen of the castle and you're my Teddy little rascal. That line, I was like, I'm gonna buy this when it comes out. Did, what you so didn't much. do because you're driving is this motion and slightly yeah. licking your upper teeth. It was far too much. It was I very sexual. The there, uh, I thought the ballet scene they did was actually really cool. Yeah. Like, I remember watching that, that and I'm like, man, amazing. what if they just divorced themselves from the idea of having to have any type of plot or even just having just like. Just get rid of the plot! Stupid... There's just far too much plot! Yeah. What the fuck would be the plot of this movie? <sighs> she needs the butthole key. <laughs> She needs the butt. Oh yeah, she's trying to find the butthole key in the magical world to unlock her music box. Because the mouse took it away. Because right. the mouse took the it. The mouse stole it. I mean, there was definitely some yeah. stylish choices that were cool. Like the Mouse King was scary and fucked up, and it was like just a pile of mouse mice. Voltron. That yeah, just <laughs> mouse Voltron exactly. <laughs> just a bunch of mice that come together and make a big giant mouse. The scary little clown people! The, clown the people. roly poly clown. That was totally right out like of a timber. They needed movie. to commit yeah. a little harder to making them scary because they kept like letting them, like, they kept letting you not see them. And I'm like, no, we need to hold them. I was like, I just want. It's clowns all the way down. It's clowns all the way down. I just want to go back to sexy baby Kira Knightley. Spoiler alert. Sugar Plum Fairy was evil all along. And then she does her sex. <laughs> yeah, but then she just sexy evil baby voice, and it, that was when I was like, okay, it doesn't make me uncomfortable anymore. Because at yeah. least she's like leaning into being the bad guy. And I'm like, all right, that's fine. I've seen this before. God, I, that man, once that happened, I was like, this is A plus film. <laughs> <laughs> it should have just all been cool ballet <laughs> and like dope costumes. It should have just been the Nutcracker Ballet, but in a movie. But you know, as every minute passes, I forget more and more about what yeah. we just saw. Well, with that. Um, Hi, everyone. Yeah, let's, uh, hey, uh, like, comment, and subscribe on Rock Punch. Listen, let's go to the movies again sometime. Yeah, let's go see the new Harry Potter. No, let's yeah, not. Maybe I'll get turned on by some other piece of... Oddly sexualized childhood. Who's locking me in?